I mean, people don't get it, man. They like medicine. Here we go again. He haven't had water in 31 days. 31 days, no water. And people say, I got to drink water. I'm thirsty. No, you're not. You're getting dehydrated. 100% dehydrated. The challenge is that uh, for my birthday, I normally don't celebrate my birthday, period, because I never found out a reason to celebrate my birthday until I found myself. At 47 years old, I'll be turning 48. I took the four, first 48 people that wanted to sign up, and for the next 25 days when I turned um, 48, um, we did a water and um, salt challenge. After this, if they continue doing it with me, this would be the last time they ever would drink water again. They would never drink water in their life again because you don't supposed to drink it. You're supposed to eat it. And that's how everything else, I don't care about that shit. I care about the health and welfare of myself and the universe. The universe is going to bring the right people around you to where you need to go. If I need to fall in love, the universe is going to bring the right person to me to fall in love with. I don't want to fall in love with myself. I love myself. Most people don't love themselves because they love their past. Because that's what they are. They don't know what their future are because they ain't never been around somebody that sit there and actually cook, clean, and actually love them for themselves. Not for who they pretend to be. For your authentic self. For the one that laughs, burps, farts. That person. Not the person who's just sitting there, oh, that was funny. <coughs> Nobody wants to hear that shit. We want you on the floor pissing on yourself, saying, oh, oh my God, I almost shit on myself. Laughing, crying, burping, farting. All that shit. That comes with it. I mean, people just don't get it, man. People don't like these fake-ass women. Got their lips blowed up, face blowed up, titties blowed up, ass blowed up, and ain't got no personality at all and can't cook at all. You got all this fake shit in your body you can't even cook. I mean, that, that, who, who wants some shit like that? I don't get myself in shape first before I can get that book done. Circulation, yes, that's what the um, cayenne pepper does or any hot pepper. It pushes the circulation. That's why you sweat. That's why your nose runs. Your nose be getting rid of the mucus that's in your nose. That's what helps get rid of um, your bronchial issues, your asthma and everything else, getting the mucus and stuff cleared out. Your lungs um, stop being inflamed and, and irritated. No, I eat meat. Yes, I eat um, apple meat, pear meat, watermelon meat, cantaloupe meat, um, grape meat. Um, that, that's the kind of meat I eat. Beans aren't good for you neither. They're gassy, they bloat the stomach up. But you can, like I told you, it's up to what you want to eat. I believe in myself. I believe we live in a firmament. Yes, mushroom tea is good. And um, lion's mane or lion mushroom or um, lion's mane, I think is good too. Fish, yes, as long as you go catch it. Beans are a carbohydrate too. All the food that you're mentioning is basically a carbohydrate. It's going to break down and turn to a sugar in your body. How to? Fish, yes, as long as you go catch it. Beans are a carbohydrate too. All the food that you're mentioning is basically a carbohydrate. It's going to break down and turn to a sugar in your body. How it breaks down and what your body uses from it, it depends on how you eat. Pumpkin seeds, apple seeds, um, um, papaya seeds, um, pear seeds, they're all good for you. Every last one of them are good for you. You only got to swallow them. Do not eat them, chew them, swallow them. And I don't understand what me believing in God has to do with what I'm sitting there saying. That's a book that somebody read. I told you I'm spiritual. I'm not religious at all. I'm spiritual. It's a big difference. It's a big difference. Kelly salt and water every day. Of course, that's better than sitting there eating at a restaurant or eating at a fast food place or eating at a convenience store. You get trace minerals and vitamins that somebody read. I told you I'm spiritual. I'm not religious at all. I'm spiritual. It's a big difference. It's a big difference. Celtic salt and water every day. Of course, that's better than sitting there eating at a restaurant or eating at a fast food place or eating at a convenience store. You're getting trace minerals and vitamins in your body. What, are, what vitamins and minerals are you getting out of your body from eating the crap that you're eating? I believe in my higher self. I believe I'm energy. Energy cannot die, so I can't believe in somebody else. I can believe in a higher power than myself, but I believe in myself as being my best version. 
These are my D-O-G, and it's spelled backwards, it's G-O-D. My greater version of myself, that's me. So whether I sit there and believe in somebody else, I can't believe in somebody else. And the whole reason I can't believe in it because I see a lot of people with my eyes right here. I see a lot of people that profess to believe in all this stuff and they're three, four, five hundred pounds. They don't take care of themselves. They